brother another tech video from me uh, because my Nexus started to go insane <laughs> so this is a small uh, fix video if you have the same problem as I did and the problem was the Nexus just kept restarting over and over again and uh, it could be two things it could be the power button which was uh, the problem in my case or it could be a burned uh, circuit if you used uh, a different charger for example like a Samsung charger so in this case it was the power button but it might not be in your case so I'm just going to explain quickly because I don't want to make a long video. If you, uh, when you remove the back panel, use a guitar pick or something uh, like a plastic fork or plastic knife or anything. Uh, you don't want to use metal things. So you loosen the back panel and you put it over there. And when you remove, uh, when you have the back panel removed, it's going to look something like this with this part over here. And you unscrew the part, this part, with a star screwdriver this or something with, with a pretty small uh, because it's six screws and they are pretty small and you need to remove the sim card as well uh, when you remove this part you're gonna get this part this is the motherboard uh, you need to unscrew it and when you unscrew it you need to loosen three things you need to loosen this you need to loosen this the battery you need to lose the front facing camera uh, the back facing camera sir and the front facing camera three connections and you use the same thing here a plastic thing you do not want to apply anything metal over here and you also need to loosen the 4G and the 3G I think I'm not sure there are antennas so yeah whatever uh, when you have this guy off the motherboard you see two buttons here and you see one button over here and this guy over here is the power button please focus please focus so when you have the power button, you can also remove, oh, there we go, the button, like the, the physical button. Yeah, this is also a physical button, but it's an internal button. So when you have this guy out, you can just try around like I did. I applied some pressure with a pair of tweezers uh, from both sides. I just press it really hard, and you can also just wiggle it around with, uh, with a screwdriver because the issue is the power button is sticky so it got stuck in some way so that's what you need to do you need to just fool around with it until it works it did not work for me the first time so I actually uh, mounted the motherboard without the button so I could apply pressure from the outside of the case uh, because this little guy right here it's not fun to deal with. You need to have like the loose part. So just be very careful when you do this. It solved my issue, uh, but I'm still gonna send it to repair. But if you want to, I don't know, back up things, uh, you have uh, authenticators and stuff you need to remove. Uh, this is this thing worked. So do not <laughs> smash your phone on a table or apply any unusual force because uh, it might break. You see the button is right there and it clicks just fine. I'm not gonna apply any pressure or anything. Uh, so there we go, four minutes. Uh, I hope it helps somebody. Well, see you around.